merchants, especially wealthy ones, make good targets for them. Are you going back to Sake, Mr. Merchant? Are you not going back to Sake, Mr. Merchant? I keep my eyes open. This is a quick current base of business, so I can't go back there easily. I'm going to remain here as long as I can. Why is that? I don't think changing the base is such a big deal. You can't do business with our customers. If you really want to sell something, you don't have a customer to buy it, you can't do anything right. With every shop here closed, no one could buy anything and people would starve. If we left the customers who rely on our shop now, we wouldn't make any money around here anymore. Well said, Master. You? Mr. Merchant. So we're officially offering great deals right now. We're not going to have as many people as possible or as well. There's no competition around. Totally, it's all about money. I'm kind of pissed. I'm kind of pissed off for having been impressed by his words. No worries, so am I. Oh God! Is there who needs the Kumagami of robbing the rice granary? What? I finally got this far. Rice granary. Oh, there's nothing we can do about it because Hannah Boost is badly injured. Great. The other granaries too. Damn to Sukomagami, stop it, that's our race! You there, you stop it, Katetsu, there's too many of them for us to deal with. But if we don't do anything, they'll take all the rice! <sighs> Katetsu and Kanatora, please stand back. Hanabusa, you alright? Yes, I'm fine, I'm going to defeat them. Hanabusa, you can't, you aren't in any condition to fight yet. I can deal with this much. Everybody hide somewhere. Oh, for goodness sake, don't you push it and make yourself worse. Oh, Hannah Boosa, sweetie. Rest. She even unlocked Marksman. Do we still have the Asusa boat? We do, and it's still just got question mark, question mark. Great. Hanabusa, be very careful. If you die, I will not be happy because you are awesome. Attack. Attack. See? P. Cooking. Give a pot. Rear pot. With a lid and everything. Then. Surprised she's not showing she's injured. P -O -T Come on, Hannah Boosa, we can do this. Attack. Hello, Rainmaker Pan. We have a copy of you that's awesome. Attack. Attack. And one more. He's done. He's dead. Excellent. Over this way. I'm feeling so cautious of her. I'm gonna make her like eat all the medicine she has in her bag right now, just so she'll be fine. <laughs> eat all the ten thousand your medicine, man. Bo. Okay, you're a bolt. And <laughs> She's gonna fall on the floor, isn't she? As soon as she's finished doing this, she'll be like, oh, I'm in so much pain. Why did I do that? Okay, done. Things are rapidly darkening for the plot line. So Creepy thing. Bend. Keep attacking. Oh, it's an HP restorer as well. Stop it. I will cleave you.
Oh, that wouldn't have hurt her, would it? Oh god. I'm so worried for her! Come on, Hanabusa, be okay after this. Please, 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 please. Get my hand away from my mouth. You like biting my nails. Oh, didn't count it. Never mind. No overreaching yourself, Bamboo. Sifting. Sift. Come on. Yes. Yeah, come on. B. Spirit Index. Sieve. Done. Keep going, go, go. Attack. Attack. Sit. You can do it. He's dead. Alright, now you go back to bed. Give someone else a chance with the Gokon sword, I think. Some problem about being the chosen one. Ugh. Oh, right, Hannah Bus, for heaven's sake, I knew this would happen. This isn't good. I'll handle it here, so please take her home. Thanks, I'll do just that. Dad and I get a deal with the rice granary. We won't let Sukumagabi rob it again for sure, so you must rest yourself well, Hanabusa. Why doesn't Sujin, like, erect a shield around it or something? Yeah, thanks. Don't let your guard down. They could still be around. We'll be fine. Let's roll, Dad. Backstreet. Backstreet. Back. Alright. Damn, but they made a mess out of the capital. I think we should be glad about the fact that we didn't take too much damage, though. Anyway, you better get our work done as quickly as possible so Komogami might return. You got it, let's hurry then. Oxcart. Hmm? Sir, I see people gathering rice bales over there. What, the rice bales? Go and seize them, we are bringing them to my mansion. Ah, uh, but... Liblens are supposed to provide us with the rest. And we're under emergency condition at the moment, so all the more so now. Now go. Walk out the door. Don't turn around now. Because you're not welcome anymore. Yes, sir. Backstreet. You people there. Who let you have that rice? Oh, a nobleman. So Komogami saw this rice here from our granary and we're it back right now. I'm afraid we're going to have to confiscate those bales since we're in charge of the rice in this area. What? Please wait. We're gonna die without this rice. Please don't do that. Savants, lolly commoners dare protest against me. Stop kidding. Who said that we said this rice is ours? You're trying to steal it from us. How can you act like that? I cannot believe your tone. I permit you to cut down this rude child. That's terrific, bring it on! No Kotetsu, stop it! I have nothing against you, but this is an order from my master. Ha! Huh? His sword just smashes <laughs> on the floor. It's shit. Gah! Oh god, can I tell her no? What? Dad! Kotetsu, run away! Dad! Dad! Don't die, Dad! Oh no, Kanatora, but you were awesome! No! Ugh, no, this cannot be happening! No, Dad! You, you bastard! Insolent whelp! Gah! You ask what Pliblens? Anyway, we're taking this rest. Dad, god damn it! Damn it all! I won't die here! I never! Waka! Effing... High class people. <laughs> they got no freaking common sense, any of them, I swear. Oh, the sword is glowing. Did he just create a Tsukumogami of himself? Or the dad? Kotetsu? I feel uneasy for some reason. Did something happen to Kotetsu? District entrance. 
We are back. Silky is back. We have everything in place. Welcome back and a great job. You're such a good girl for such a shoddy. Don't call Saki short. She's going to grow tall soon. <laughs> right, right. My bad. We replaced and added new locks. They may not make much of a difference, but she'd be better than nothing. Thank you. Were you with Kotetsu and Kanatora? Aren't they back yet? I thought they came here already since we took rather long. Boy, we should have checked up on them. I think we could do it now. <laughs> Master, I smell something funny. Look! Zombie ca Zombie Kotetsu? Tsukumagami Kotetsu? Kotetsu and Kanatora? Kotetsu, what in the world happened? What happened to Kanatora? Hanabusa Okuni. Hmm, this kid. Across from Sister Great Hall. Some nobles for harassing the harassing us for the race. I protested and then they murdered my dad. By the gods. No, Kanatora. Kotetsu, how about you? Are you alright? Yeah, I'm alright. I'm not hurt or anything. Okay, if you're sure. This rice gruel is from Mr. Merchant. You must eat it so you'll get better. Yeah, thanks. Where's Dad? He's been laid down in the other room. You should go see him. Sure. Uncle Kanatora, how could this happen to him? <coughs> Are you feeling ill, Walker? No, I'm fine. I must be a little tired because so much has happened. What about you, Hanabusa? Please don't go too far until you've recovered. Sure, I won't. Actually, I feel completely okay now thanks to the medicine Mr. Merchant gave me. It's so good it can heal your bones automatically. He is obviously some kind of wizard. Across Mystic Great Hall. Miss Okuni, is it true there isn't much left rice in your troops' granary? How do you know that? Get out of my house, Doug. God damn it, we have sick people and dead people. Seriously, go away. The amount of rice there has obviously been decreasing. Will we die of hunger? Perhaps we should rob some rich merchants, Granary. What are you saying? What makes that better than a common gummy? But... I know how dire our situation is, but committing such a crime means renouncing life as a human and turning into a demon. This means this is the time to stand firm. Please don't take that wrong step. But what if we die? I have a child to feed. I cannot live on pretty words. I'm leaving this troop. What? Well, hey, just wait. Goodbye, Miss Okuni. A couple of days later, and Hannah Booster is fully mended. I've been feeling it pretty good lately. I think I can return to hunting Sukumagami. Hey, Hannah Booster, you look in good shape. Mr. Merchant, that medicine you gave me has worked wonders. I managed to heal internal bleeding and everything. Thank you so much for bringing that. Is that going to be 100,000 million year medicine? This is the medicine the dinosaurs made. <laughs> Back in the early, tri early Triassic. I'm glad it worked. So do you think you can reciprocate my effort? Oh, what is it you need? Luckily we're about to gain race. We're about to transport it here, but the Sukumagami be hanging around the waterway. So I'm wondering if you'll be good enough to escort us on our way there. Rice? Everybody's going to be excited about that. And of course, I'm happy to help you. Master, can we can't eat rice? Hooray! Choo, choo, choo. You can eat as much as we want this time, though. Alright then, we'll see you tomorrow morning. Accept the merchant's request. It's one thing. Um, let's talk to Sujin and see what's going on with him. And if it's nothing, we can then just like go to recording session. Sujin, you strained with Gijin before, didn't you? It's almost impossible to leave that, considering the way he is now. Understandable. He was quiet. He was a quiet and thoughtful man. I'm sure something terrible has befallen him. 
You mean something changed his personality? That's what I think. And unlike now, he never looked down on anybody. If anything, he was too reserved, and that's no exaggeration. He really was a respectable man, despite that. I know how you two had time together, but it sounds like he's a completely different person now. Yeah, I hope he turns back into the Yoshimi, I know. What's up, Hanabusa? Seems you destroyed all the skulls. High priests and local residents, I've been very grateful to you. These are a small token of our appreciation. Paper doll times three. Right then, good luck with the rest of the skulls. Wait, have we been missing out on stuff all this time? Can we talk to him again and see if we get anything else? Skull hunt coming along. I need to go to Isagahara, the tavern district, before we're done. Thank you so much for your help. Completely forgot about the voice then for a second. Right. Talk to this blue person and then... By the way, what are your parents like? My parents? My father has retired. My mother passed away many years ago. Oh my god, this song's so sad. Oh, I'm sorry for asking. Well, he not, but I guess it's a good chance to tell you about them. Father said he was like me in his youth. He was good, smart, and skilled enough to be a leader among the foxes, and so handsome that many females wanted him. So where's the similarity? Oh, bitch. However, he met my mother. Since he met my mother, he never had an affair. He loved her deeply without caring about the fact that she came from an ordinary family. But it prevented him from rising in rank. Though he defended her, the other foxes would never accept her. And she threw herself into a river. She must have thought she was a burden for her husband. There was only a comb left on the riverside. Even if we belong to the same species, those with high ranks despise lowly ones. How ironic. It's the same for us humans, too. You aren't even allowed to like someone of a different station. Precisely. I feel like he was her decision to leave him. And as he picked up her comb, he decided to retire. I see. It was a tragic love. Not sure if it was tragic or not, but I believe she's still alive somewhere. She is alive inside your heart, dear sir. She is alive inside your heart. <laughs> that made me feel sick just saying that. However low the chances, I believe my parents will see each other again one day. Yes, I believe so too. Oh, isn't that nice? Let's just check. Okay, so we've got three paper dolls. That's okay. So we have to go defeat the thing in Isugaihara. We have to go and accept the merchant's request. And we're going to have to defeat that thing in the tavern district as well. But all that can happen another time. So I think... I ha oh my goodness, I've just seen how much money we've got. Oh my days, that's a lot. Uh, but for now, I'm Paige of Maces. It's been 99 Spirits, TTFN.